Hi, I'm Doug. I've been a fitness and rehabilitation professional for 29 years. What I wanted to avoid with this thing is guruism. Guruism is Actually, where I, I, I can tell. Yep. I want to not do that yep. because that's where it's just like one guy's opinion. And if you look in all of the things that are offered to personal trainers, a physical therapist, there's a hell of a lot of this where a guy is like, well, I've been doing this for so many years. I developed this unique technique and you have to come to my class and I'll, it's $15,000 and I'll teach you exactly how to do all these techniques that'll cure everything. That's guruism. Yeah, you don't have There's a difference. What we're doing is science. This is, we're not saying that we invented anything in a, in a, in a big sense. We just applied science in a, in a unique way, but we took what was out there, what was proven to work, and we put it all together in one giant thing. So we're the opposite of guruism. I don't want this to be about Doug. I want this to be about the neuroelastic approach, which is to use science and apply science to questions about that, that elderly people face, like I'm falling, I can't turn, I can't lift my leg up, I shuffle when I walk, I don't feel comfortable getting dressed. Those, those questions, we apply science to it and we ask science, what's the most efficient way to help this person regain this ability? And that's what neuroelastic is. Neuroelastic isn't Doug's opinion. Neuroelastic is what the science suggests is the, is the ideal way to go. And that's why looking at these research articles is so crucial because not only is neuroelastic an approach, it's a dynamic approach because as more research comes out, we might change what we, what we suggest as the best way to help people. So if we find out later on that, you know, there's a different way to improve falls or to reduce the risk of falls, um, we will incorporate it into the system because our approach is to use whatever the most recent and, and uh, um, well-reviewed research is to make our, our decisions about what's the best way for us to proceed. And if we keep doing that, it's the opposite of guruism. Guruism is very static, it never changes. What we're doing is gonna constantly change as the research points in new directions. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to see more videos like this. If you wanna access my full training course, click the link below in the description. This is not physical therapy or medical training. It is not meant to be medical advice to anyone. It is intended only as educational information for trainers and therapists. No one should ever perform an exercise without consulting with their doctor or medical professional.